all gamers, man, your gaming station. There is a new update out on Arsenal. It is update 2.9.9. Uh, it just came out. I, th I believe they did update it earlier, but there was an issue. There was like a message right here that said uh, there's an issue with the update. It'll come out later. Uh, here's a uh, the devel development post for it. I will be reviewing that in a second. Uh, they also added a new trailer for this update. I'm not going to show it because that's basically like stealing their video. I'm not going to do that. We are here on the Arsenal um, developer page forum posting for update 2.9.9. Yeah, 2.9.299. I'm just going to say that. Um, they have some pretty cool pictures here. It looks pretty cool. Um, so, there is a lot of new stuff they added, mostly these guns. I I will review every single gun here, except for this thing, because I can't unlock that. That is a uh, melee knife thingy that I cannot buy at the moment. But they added uh, four new guns. That's pre Okay, actually, five guns, which is pretty epic. Uh, they also added a new map called Villa, which is pretty nice. I will be looking through that as well. They also... Buff the firework launcher, I also will be checking that out, but I can already tell it's basically just going to be the same thing except more damage. Uh, it's not really going to make it any more usable. Uh, they also did some other stuff as well, uh, like some UI changes, which I will be checking out. They also added a skateboard and some other stuff, and if you want to read the entire post, I will probably leave the link into the description. Alright, so I just loaded into the uh, menu. There's a new little GUI up here. Start pack, exclusive skin, plus get a bonus character and flare case. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and click on here. 95 Robux? Uh, I, I will actually do that. I think that's a pretty good deal. Um, ooh, what's in here? Okay, yeah, uh, I'll... Nah, uh, uh, next crate, next crate. Come on. Um. Yeah, I, I'm fine with that. That's a pretty cool emote, actually. Um, there's also some new skins as well. Uh, I will be looking into that. Uh, I cannot get them at the moment, but uh, there are some new skins and some other crap as well. Also, I've noticed they added GUI at the uh, bottom there. It shows you what mode it is. Um, it's actually pretty good because uh, sometimes I load into the game and I do not know what mode it is even though it says at the top, you know, standard up there. I am actually blind so I do not notice what mode it is 9% of the time I'm playing. So that is a nice feature just to, you know, let you know what mode it is. Um, yeah, that's pretty cool. Alright, so I have the PPSH. It is a new gun. It is a submachine gun. Is it a submachine gun? I'm pretty sure the PPSH counts as a submachine gun. Anyway, um, so can one of you, like, stand right here real quick? I just want to test the PPSH out on you. Okay, cool. Yeah, blue guy. Alright, cool. Um. Yeah, I mean, the, I, I think, I guess it's fine. I, uh, I guess I'll just test the spread out now. Alright, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and test the spread out, um, I'm gonna use this wall right here, I'm gonna go back here, alright, hey, Ricky, do I need to kill you? Okay, you know what, I just die. Uh, one thing that's weird about the PPSH, uh, it does not have the reload sound, but I think that's because the, uh, like, if I shoot, yeah, it does not have a reload sound yet, I think that's because the sound has not yet loaded into, uh, Roblox, has... The game only just got updated. Uh, hey, Ricky, can you just move around? I just want to test the spread out real quick. No. Uh, the gun's actually pretty good. It looks like it's having a massive amount of recoil, but it's not actually having that much recoil. It's, it's pretty good. I like the PPSH. It's pretty cool. It's pretty epic. How many die clowning? Epic. Alright, Ricky, I have the FAMAS. Is that cool? No. It does a lot of damage, um, okay, hold on. I, from what I've heard from this gun, it does two damage at long range, is that cool? Wait, 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 Cl clowning, clowning, come, okay, Ricky, come over here real quick. Alright. St stand, me. just stand right here, clowning, me. stand right here. I'm gonna test this at long range, okay, it's not super long range, but it's Dude, long range. Alright, are you standing still, Ricky? You don't look like you're standing still, alright. What? Oh, that's 20 damage. It's not that bad. Wait, hold on. Can I kill you? Yeah. Okay, oh. yeah, I, I just killed you. Is that cool? Is that cool, Ricky? No, Ricky139, no, owner of Plane Crazy that has 2,000 players. Is that cool? Do you want me to, uh, to uh, uh, beat you in this game? No? Yes? 
You're a loser. Um, it does 26 uh, damage at close range to the bot. That's pretty nice. All right, what about your head clowning? This might kill you. Okay, it does 27. Okay, that makes zero sense. But okay. Um, I'm not sure about the spread on this weapon. It seems to be pretty fine, actually. Yeah, I mean, I, I can deal with that. It's not that bad. Um, clowning, time to die. Yeah, it's not too bad. I also like the AUG. They're pretty comparable, actually. They're not too bad, not too bad. What do you think? What do you think, clowning? It's pretty cool, right? It's pretty cool, right? He said yes in the chat. Well, actually, he said yes, but, you know, that's basically yes. Alright, so I have the A12, uh, which is an auto shotgun. I have not used this yet, but it has 20 rounds or shells, I guess, and it is a shotgun, so it's doing shotgun things on the wall. That's pretty cool. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and try out the shotgun on these dudes real quick. Alright, um, Spaz 12. Okay, just one shot at him. Okay, that shotgun's pretty cool at cl close range. Also, it says match leader on the bottom left. That's pretty cool. I think that's new. I did not notice it until now, so I'm pretty sure it's new. All right, uh, Ricky, how's it going? Th only 32 damage. That's okay. I guess yeah. that, that's a two shot at medium range. We're going to try out long range now. It's going to be pretty solid. Now I'm going to try out the uh, long range A12. Oh, wow. Okay, clowning. How's it going, buddy? Okay, that somehow didn't even do any damage. That's pretty dumb. I'm just gonna go full auto. Yeah, I mean, it's an auto shotgun. I, I don't know what I expected. It's some big... That's a lot of uh, spread right there. Uh, <laughs> well, I, it's an auto shotgun, so I don't know what I was expecting. But it's pretty cool. I like the A12. It's a pretty solid gun. Pretty cool. <laughs> Alright, so now I have the dual prismas, or I guess they're just called prismas. Like, because, you know, plural. Um, I have no idea what I'm about to expect here, but, uh, ooh, 27 damage. Ooh, 55 damage. That's pretty cool. How much for a headshot? It does 34. Um, I guess they're okay. Um, they're just dual pistols. They're dual pistols. That That's, that's it. Goodbye and try these at long range I just want to see if they're any good at pretty solid long range so clowning's over there all right hold hold still clowning hello yeah they are fairly accurate I'm pretty sure they're just gonna be pretty OP at long range as well um, yeah those are pretty good guns I don't see or uh, have any issues with them all right, now I got the XR-15, which is apparently a, uh, it's, it's this. Yeah, I don't like this gun because of this. I only like fully automatic. Um, now you die. <laughs> I do not like this gun because it is dual, uh, burst fire. It shot, it shoots two shots, uh, at a time. I don't like that. Uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, clowning, could you follow me real quick? Yeah, just come over here real quick, bro. Yeah, yeah, just stand, just stand right here. I just gotta test his gun out at long range. Can you get out of the way? Thanks, yellow dude. All right, cool. All right, um, clowning. Yeah, I feel like that gun is gonna be complete aids at long range because it just takes one shot to miss, and it's like, yeah, sorry, bro. But yeah, it's pretty okay, I guess. I I don't like it though. Alright, now I have the L86A3, which is like the British Army assault rifle thingy. I don't know. Um, it has a weird sound. It has a weird sound. That's sounds, uh, you know, weird. Uh, hold on, let me test the damage out real quick. That's 19 damage. Alright, what about to the head? Yeah, it does 27 damage to the head, which is pretty expected. Mr. Clowning, come over here. I just gotta, you know, test out the long range real quick. Yeah, just stand right there. I just want to see how this gun does at long range. All right, cool. All right. It's fairly inaccurate, but I think if you burst fire this gun, it'll not be too bad. Actually, let me try that. All right, I'm gonna try shooting in bursts out of him. All right, here we go. Eh. It kind of takes a while to uh, get a kill with that if you burst fire it. And if you go full auto at long range, you might miss a few shots, which is... But overall, I think the gun's pretty 
okay, I mean, it's not anything special. They have also added a skateboard emote. It's an emote, but it's not really a emote. So if you press uh, G right there. Alright, cool. This is the skateboard. Uh, by the way, if you jump, it will uh, throw it away. Uh, so go ahead and re-equip it. It will go uh, through, uh, like, uh, jump over stuff so it won't get stuck like actual Roblox skateboards. Uh, to j actually jump, you have to click. So if we click right here, it does like a little jump. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Um, from what I know, you can actually go above higher things than you usually can in Arsenal. For example, uh, this thing right here. If we jump over here, it goes above it. It's pretty solid. Um, this emo is pretty cool. It costs twelve hundred uh, dollars in the store. It is very much worth it if you have the cash for it. And um, yeah, I do like it. It's pretty cool. It's completely useless like every other emo. You know, it has nothing to do with the game, but it's pretty fun to use. And you can also drive off the map if you, you know, want to die. Whee! All right, as you guys can see on the left side, people are spamming the chat, and there are people spamming sounds through the megaphone. So if we press M real quick, and we are going to go ahead and go into the settings right here. All right, we're going to go ahead and enable streamer mode and go back into the game real quick. All right, we're going to go back over here. Oh, there's no more Hamoud and spamming music. That's pretty epic. And if you look on the left side, there is no more spam in the chat. This mode, I like this mode. This mode is epic. Right, I have the firework launcher. Also, uh, it shows on the top uh, hum, uh, what streak you have. That's pretty cool. I like that a lot. The firework launcher has also been buffed slash reworked. So we're going to go ahead and try that out. I can jump up using this uh, still. That's pretty normal. All right. 65 damage. I don't know how this is going to really redo anything for it. But all right. Um, hmm. The firework launcher is just does more damage just that's really it um i guess the area of damage has increased but i'm not entirely sure but it does do more damage so that's nice i guess but um i still would not use this thing if i had a choice time to die ricky thing no! right, so now i'm gonna go ahead and finish the game real quick so i'm gonna kill this dude all right now it says i won the game right here as you can see and it also says the player level which is pretty cool i like that you can see what level the player is you know it's kind of useless because the the kills are basically what your level is so that's kind of dumb but eh, it's a nice ad it's pretty cool this is a new map they just added to arsenal it's called uh villa which is oh cool i just fell off there's uh, a lot of these pathways by the way uh they just added this uh in this update it looks pretty cool it is quite plain though there's not much to it there's just a uh, building a couple of hallways a staircase we can go up here um there's a few rooms but nothing major hold on let me just kill that dude and this dude yeah, I don't like these people shooting. They're kind of annoying. Um, there's also a gate here, but you can't go through it, obviously. Uh, the main thing about this map is there's a lot of, like, these pathways which you can, like, go through. Uh, if we go down here, yeah, you can go down here. That this, uh, you can come down, uh, up here and then jump down and kill people, anyone who's trying to go there. That's going to be pretty common, I think, uh, during gameplay. Uh, it does stretch around the entire map, so you can basically just run around the whole map using that but as i said people up here can you know shoot you or jump down and knife you you can go up here if there is another part where you can walk around again that's pretty cool i'm just gonna win the game now um yeah can i win the game that'd be pretty cool all right there we go yeah the map's uh pretty cool um nothing special just a normal map i guess we are on the familiar uh, hillside map, uh, but as you guys can see, the map has been edited a bit. It has fall colors, which is pretty cool. We got red, we got orange, we got yellow, we got a slightly different shade of orange. Uh, we got red, we got green that they probably forgot to remove because, you know, I don't, it doesn't really matter. We got orange, we got yellow, we got shade of orange, red, yellow again, slightly different shade of orange. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, other than that, that's pretty much it. I think other maps uh, also have fall colors, such as Safe House, but I, I'm i too lazy to actually go check. But I'm sure they changed that. Um, 
But looks pretty cool. I do like that they're actually changing the colors to fall colors and so on. It's pretty cool.